Tension. Did he take damage? That was a good question. Did who take yeah. yeah, he did take damage. I just did the damage, but it didn't it didn't stick. Oh, it is sticking, so... It just doesn't look I can, like I can it. See it. Let me just move the body. Yeah, there we go. Ah. Is there something behind uh, it? I yeah, think there, I think there is something it, yeah. behind it. What's behind it? The bandit oh, that's bandit. your aura. Your aura's... Wait, what's... Oh, the, the other bandit. bandit. The other bandit body. Okay, so... There. There we go. Alright, let's see. Uh... So that one's being oh, grappled, so you don't want to mess with that one. You have the one in front of you, which is trying to beat you to death. You have the one on the left, which is engaged with Spicoli. So it's a battle of giants. It's a giant. It's a metal monster versus a rock monster. I'll deal with the one in front of me. Uh, first things first. I'm going to use uh, as an action. You present your host pistol. Prayer of denunciation. Using your Let's roll it. <laughs> All right. Roll it and we'll see if it's wrong or not. All right. Using this. Uh, Abjure enemy. So you. So you're channeling Present your divinity. Must make a wisdom Present save throw. So. That's below. So. I present my holy. Is it immune to being? Is a, that's a question. Is that a thing immune to being frightened? It's immune to we'll psychic we'll damage. We'll okay, so... That's about it. So it's not immune to fright. Shouldn't be. Okay, so it's not immune to fright. So it is frightened now. Uh, the creature's frightened Ooh. for one minute, which is it's frightened for a long time. Yeah. Reduced to zero and can't benefit from most moving speed. Um. Alright. So it can't move and it's fight. stunned, so... Yeah, I pull it's out scared, the curled symbol. Up the you pull out your symbol. <laughs> I pull out the the holy symbol, which is um, it's an amulet. He pulls, he pull, he like shows it to the creature. He's like, "I am a paladin of the Church of Crane, and today you will die." Yeah, so it's like it it stops <laughs> moving. It's it's having a hard time comprehending what you're saying, but it's enough to stop it from moving. Okay, so Olga is like um, Olga walks up to Niltor and it's like uh, while they're distracted, we should probably see if uh, we should probably get into town. <laughs> As Marky screams, Vicoli's rock two... elemental screams. There you go. So, yeah, hand. pimp hand. <laughs> I still have two actions, though. Okay, so... You still have two actions. Still have two attacks. Oh, you still... Oh, yeah, you didn't... Attacks. That was your bonus. Okay, well, do what you're gonna do. First one. And... Second one. So... That, uh, the second one will miss. So the first one will hit, so that's 9, it's 14. Ding. So it's, the, right, cards, it's like a light gouge against its hull. Okay, so... And then just see Say, because Olga just moved, and uh, <laughs> so Say, you're up. Like, she can't really do much else, like, she's a combat creature. She's not going to leap off the wall crazily to go at the target. Say, uh, falling. Okay, so. And that's about all I can do. Okay, so bandits, which means the enemy. Which also means that's not all of them. <laughs> so it's like, um. So you keep hearing the same shouting from the right. What are you lot doing? You call that fighting? <laughs> <laughs> So, you know, I'd like to see who the hell's in the yeah. back. Hopefully what you see, well, uh, how far can you see? That's a perception, because you're, Marky, you're the closest. Can you see beyond the kind of, so Spicoli and Marky, you're the closest, so you're the ones that have to roll perception. Challenge rating is five. Come on, it's easy. <laughs> so you there see, in the center of the town, there looks like it's a very, it's a very large man, if you can call it a man. He's wearing a he's wearing a long coat and he looks like an admiral. Uh oh, he's okay. He does. Uh, but he's not he's alone. Not Behind him eyes. there's two more. There's like they look like it's a group of them, it's not just one. So the one that's shouting is the one in the front, but the other two are in the back, they're they're idle. I'm gonna assume these are the Navy commander. Okay, so 
but that's not all of them. Surrounding them is, uh, there's at least a couple soldiers beyond them, so... Like, they have, a, like, at the center of town there are stone golems guarding them. It's not the, it's not these little would-be constructs in the front, no, they, they have much stronger golems in the back. I will destroy those golems. Okay, so... Pussies! No, it's like, uh... So, and you see one of the, you see one of the admirals, he's, uh, kind of playing with his wrist, and you see that more golems are starting to rise from the ground. These ones are not as, like, robust, they looks like they're meant, these were created by magic. They're like clay golems. I will destroy the shit out of this. It's like, uh... Where the fuck's our It's part? like, what are you doing? Don't let them get any closer! Boom. So, Spicoli, you're up. Scared? Wow. How is the range? The range. Well, let's see. You're out of yeah, you're out of their man, effective range. This. Yeah, don't worry. And still, we just take care of the guys in front of us first. And then they are we'll all large the creatures. Yeah, pretty much. So you're large too, man. Okay. Big. You're. you're anyway, large. moving on. This is just a. Uh... So what now? I mean, Spicol, you're up. It's your turn. Smash time. Double smash. Okay, it's all. Oh. Go ahead, roll it. Yeah, just roll it. So that's a failure, and that's a failure. So the the creature's getting your measure. It's this time. It's uh, instead of just taking it like uh, it's gonna get slammed in the face. Now it's moving edge with agility. Okay, so Thorin, he's still gonna move quite a bit. So. <laughs> He's got to move through the blasted rubble, but he's got to be at, like, it'll be half the speed because it's a lot of rubble, so. So he can only move up to there. So, Niltor, you're up again. You're using your hand to crush whoever that is. Well, so two. Yeah, two to six, but about five. Okay, so. So roll it. I'm trying to get. Kind of see behind the pimp hand, but it's difficult. Yeah, but. Are you, gonna, are you rolling anything? Or? Okay. Yeah, I'm rolling right, right now. Yeah, so... 16, but I 16. can... That is actually a bonus action, so I can move it if I want to. Okay. I'm gonna do. So you're still on the I wall. Move. I move up on Marky. Okay, so... Alright, so Marky, right. you're up again. Wait, it's... Okay, so that was Spick, Thor, and Niltor, and then me again. Okay. Yep. Uh, I've got... I'm gonna cast Vow of Mitty. No. So, okay. As a bonus, I'm gonna put it in. Put it <laughs> It's like, don't tell me what it does. As a bonus, as a bonus yeah. action, you can utter a Vow of Enmity against a creature within yeah. ten feet of you. I can read. Uh, so thanks. That one. <laughs> I can't, it's a, that's why I say put it in, so I can read it. So. All right. So basically, this lets me so do advantage on attack rolls. Bonus. Didn't you yeah. already have advantage because they were baned? Or is that just um, disadvantage no, they on have them? Dis no, it's. Yeah, disadvantage on their save rolls. Okay, so you have advantage on the creature, so... That was first one. And this Great. is... Second one. Nope. Ha! <laughs> Double 25! Boss. So roll it. Or roll damage, because that's above his armor. So it's minus 13, and then it's minus 12. So you're just trying to cut it to pieces, but it's not holding, so... Olga's gonna move... Ten feet. Is she brave enough? She is crazy enough to leap off the wall. So she's gonna leap at the one you're attacking. Oh, wow. From on top of the wall onto its head. And he... So... And rip at its head. Uh, we're about to find out. So this is an advantage, because it's a surprise attack from above. Still, a, it's a miss. She is a piece of garbage. <laughs> she calls herself what is a hunter. Hold on. She has a plus... She has a plus five. How is she failing with a plus five? No idea. What is this roll? What is this madness? Is this I don't know. Is what is this madness? So, it's because it's a stone construct. It's, you know, she is using natural weapons. She's using just her natural claws. And it's not going to do much against metal hide. But this is... I know, but this is the third time she used... She got an 11. The time she got yeah. an 11. How is Praise this? RNG, Jesus. So, like, she's, um... <laughs> but she's still on top of the thing, and she's, uh, Is that enough to blind it? No, it's not enough to blind it. So, I have something say you're up. 
Um, You're just trying to move inside. The cannons have gone silent because most of them were either disintegrated, ripped off the wall, or unmanned. Just gonna walk along the edge of the hunger of Hadar. Yeah, so. And so, uh, like, uh, you're walking casually, and Heartflame's like, do you ever get tired of using that spell? D did you just... You, you saw what it just did, right? Yeah, but does it get kind of boring using the same level of destruction every single time? I have been varying my spells quite a bit, like... It's like, yeah, it's two. Really yeah. Eldrith Bolt, uh, Eldrith Blast, and that thing. <laughs> well, Eldritch Blast is the only damaging spell that I can use without, you it's know... It's like, you need to diversify. <laughs> She's like, casual conversation, in the middle of a battle. It is physically impossible for me to diversify. It's like, uh... It's like, I wouldn't go that far. Like, she's... Now it's like an innuendo. Hmm. <laughs> so, just casually strolling from okay, that. Okay, so... Then we, I guess we move back to the enemy, so... So, he's got, like, he's gonna try to blast Piccoli, because he can still attack. Does he have disadvantage on his attacks, though? Because of a uh, ban. Yeah, D4 minus D4. Yeah. Okay. Minus so D4. he's gonna use his multi attack. He's gonna blast you with his protection. fist. And he has and protection, so it's disadvantage. So it's like <laughs> this guy just has no luck. Oh, he does have luck, I guess. Yeah. So D4. Old D4. Grit four. Come two. On. So minus oh. two. So your armor class as a stone golem was what again? Seventeen. Okay. So oh. that lowers okay, it to so sixteen and eighteen. Is. One of them will impact. So that's 12 plus 10, so... 22, 11. Yeah, so let me put up... Yeah, uh, what was your temporary health at? 126, I have 126, it and then you just lost... Hold on, I'm, I'm, uh, I'm out of there. 11. Yet, so minus... Why 11? There's 12 because plus 10. Damage reduction. How oh, so there's damage reduction on that? Yeah, uh, damage resistances. Budgeting, piercing, slashing, ah, okay. Oh, resistances. Yeah. It's like reductions. I didn't remember that. It's like resistances. Use the wrong word. I'm used to I'm reduction. Used to, mm -hmm. I'm used to resistance. Well, I, I use the terminology of D and D, and that's resistance. But reduction, I'll remember that for next time. Okay, so Thorin. Now that Thorin is able to, well, he's gonna just bull rush straight to it and do a triple attack because he's in. He, you know, he, he goes. Go straight into it, goes into rage mode, and then just goes for the beating it to death with its axe, or with his axe. Now oh, that it's a bigger oh. foe, he can't just outstrength it. He has to actually kill it legitimately <laughs> with his, because uh, if he tries to strength roll it, it's an auto fail if it's a size larger than you. So taking his axe in both hands, he just, uh, is this normal or advantage? No, there's no advantage uh, uh, extras on him. Uh, it saves minus D4 on its saves. So okay, so I'll just uh, I'm just gonna beat him to death then. So, yeah. so both hit anyway. his axe is highly enhanced. He actually enhanced it to ridiculous levels. So that's why that's all over his armor works. threshold. There's no way he could resist any of that damage. So is 19 a crit for him? Is 19 a crit for him? No. I remember it being imp if you were. Oh, never mind. Okay, so. Yeah, not have that uh, thing. Nope. So. No, it's got to be a twenty on the dice on the random dice. Actually, a good no. question. Uh, so, what is his? Because uh, that's. But uh, you're right. It's supposed to have a threshold of what his crits are supposed to do. So. I mean, this if this weapon's so highly advanced. Yeah. So. Is it a 19 mm -hmm. to 20 thing? Mm -hmm. I'm, about, I'm trying to figure that one out. So. I forget how high he can hit, so it's a d20 plus 10. So it's plus 10. So his crit is, yeah, it's pretty much the last one is a crit. So that's, uh... His damage basically, what, it's tripled? <laughs> I don't remember that correctly. Oh, no, because he's got eight. a... No, hold up, hold up, hold up. Because he has a special trait which gives him two more critical dies along with the one critical die when he attacks. Yeah, triple damage. So he gets he gets his damage plus two more times. So that's seventeen times three. <laughs> so you have the two normal attacks he dished out, which is we'll do twelve and f wait. I already did all three. Never mind. 
So it's his last, so it'll be 18 times 3. So 17 plus 18 plus 18. So in total, he does 89 damage. <laughs> because the last one is the most vicious wow. blow. And, uh. <laughs> so the last one also, it disarms him, like, you know. He's bashed, like, he bashes the shield aside with one slash, with the other slash, he, like, lodges it in his torso just to disorient it. And then he, with this last slash, he just cuts his right arm off, so he doesn't have a weapon now. What are barbarians? Okay, so. <laughs> he's a creature of rage, what did you expect? <laughs> so, Niltor. I didn't expect anything. Mm -hmm. This one is the, is the ladder, right? Yeah, that's the uh, ladder. So. Gonna go down the ladder and you. I can't see past the pimp hand. <laughs> okay, thank you. Pimp hand. Yeah. I'm gonna use extra attack though. Okay, it's so. Two regular rapier attacks. Okay, so. It's well, okay. So yeah, it seems like when in the heat of battle, the let's see, is that every time? So in the heat of battle, the sword will always be obeying you. That's just a given, because it's a life or death struggle, and if you fall here, so will it. So, win battle, it doesn't say anything, but it will cooperate. So, roll your attacks. That is a hit, and that is also a hit. So, roll damage. So, minus ten, and then, I don't think they're, they're not resistant to fire, so. So, there you oh, go. And as a bonus action, I'm going to use uh, one really big... You're gonna use what? Hand again. Okay. Why are you gonna use it again? <laughs> to do what? Nothing. Oh yeah, the the damage. Okay, so roll the damage. Face. I can't move the pimp hand. You have to move the pimp hand. So so roll roll Bigsby's damage. Yeah, you know, yeah. Purple pimp hand. Double check what the damage was. Yeah, okay. two to six plus. Two to plus six five. plus five. Yeah. Okay. So. Oh, minus 14, so... Okay, so there you go. Mark, you're up again. Let's hope you're awake. Are you alive? Okay, yeah. yeah. Wake up. I am. It's time. I'm awake. I'm alive. Okay. So, Ogle's uh, on top of his head, and it's, uh, it's not enough to cause disadvantage, but it is disorienting him a little bit. Alright, let's see. Uh, He's still I frightened from... Let's see, hold on, let me... Uh, and also you have to take the one I'm grasping. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Is he so. still frightened? Uh, he has to roll wisdom to counter that, right? Yeah, so he has to roll. Isn't it above wisdom. 17? <laughs> yeah. And isn't it he's at disadvantage as well because of Bane? Yeah. So he's pretty much boned, isn't he? So he's stuck in fear <laughs> mode. <laughs> Great. All right. So. Right. So what are you gonna do now? I don't know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go up. T is Olga attack still attacking you, or is it? Uh, just Olga's trying to, but her claws are ineffective against metal armor. Okay. She's uh, not a. Very, she's not like she's a. She's a hunter. She's me. meant to hunting beasts, not hunting these things. Leave this. I thing. think I have. I have an idea. Uh, no, hold on. I have an idea. Um, I'm gonna try and intimidate it to surrendering. Intimidate it to surrendering. Submit. Yeah. Uh, that is going to hit the standard rules, which says if you try to do a skill check on it like that, it'll auto fail. Just for size rating. Can I'll I try it? Because so. that, that applies to ability checks. Yeah, you could. Spicoli can try because he's of a similar size. Submit All right, to me. How about, how about not intimidation? How about. Yeah, any uh, skill check or. Ability score check that you try will automatically fail against a creature that's larger than you. That was just a standard rule we added. Oh, that was a standard rule at the game, apparently. Alright, um... You know what, I'm gonna attack it, and this time I'm gonna actually start using my smite skill, so... So, use uh, divine smite. <laughs> Don't hit this, I wanna do something funny. This one? Oh, that one, that's fine. You can take care of that the one. The one that's weak as shit. Okay, so advantage, you're using smite, so roll damage. Yeah, but first I'm going to roll both attack. Roll both attacks. Oh, wait, that's you, not right. Yeah, that's not uh, an advantage. So this is an advantage. Okay, so and then you roll damage. Now I roll It's really just roll. you double the radiant damage. So that's 12 and plus 8, that's 20. 
Oh, it's a 2d8. Never mind. Roll two 2d8s. What, wait, what level are you casting Divine Smite from? Uh, level 2. Level 2, so you have... 3d8. No, you have a... He does have a 2... Yeah, he has a 3d8. Okay. No, wait, it's 2d8. Ah, oh, well, never mind. Just uh, just go with it. It is a 3d8, so... You can only get the maximum you can cast it as the 4th slot. So, that's 3d8, that's 1, so... 16... That's 32 14, for the first attack. And then what's next? Just click it and hit oh. up, and then it'll re-roll what you just rolled. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah, old school. There we go. 14. Okay, so 14 <laughs> plus 7. Okay, so... Minus 7, and then minus another 7 because of the the standard damage. So you did quite a bit of damage, but, yeah. Still alive. So oh, Olga's sorry. on top of its head, and... Can you tell Olga to get off? No, she's not going to. I mean, just... Uh, then she's yeah, going to so. take the full brunt of the hit. Okay, you're going to really attack her. So no, she's not no. on top of yours. She's on top of the other one trying to collect. No, to but I had an idea. Okay, so... But she's still up there, so she's not going to get... She's, there's a foe in front of her. So she slashes down into a vulnerable spot, and it does quite a bit of haywire damage. Um... Unfortunately, like there is repercussions, which is... The thing is disabled now, and there's a good chance it's not going to fight again, so it's kind of down. Problem is, she gets electrocuted. Oh! Fuck, fucking so idiot. She goes flying a good... What? She goes flying a good five feet off the creature, and this thing just slams into the ground. And she meets the hand of... No, the hand is supposed to, the hand is supposed to be on top of that thing. In a okay. grappling, yeah, so. Ah! Okay, so, just move it back when, okay, say you're up. So, you were in a visual, uh, were you in an angle where you saw that, you know, Olga just got electrocuted. And she took that, almost 50% of her damage, so she lost 20 health. Was I in an angle? That is the question. Okay, so, that was a no. So, you didn't see any of that happen. You didn't hear any of that happen either, with all the the noise of constructs and people bashing each other to death. Wait, so those com that construct's still alive there in front of Spicoli, right? This one's yeah. mine, don't take Yeah, he's gonna do whatever he's gonna do. <laughs> if he did, um, if he take it, I'm gonna Thorin does it. understand what an honor kill is compared to Olga, who doesn't. <laughs> so. Those are the one I'm grasping with my... Okay, so you guys are just gonna move forward? Just keep moving. Spicoli's just saying, mine. Come here, Rang. <laughs> just get moving. The goal is just staring um, at this one thing one. lying. <laughs> and then... I think uh, the we're in range. Yeah. We're in range. Oh. Oh. Good. I'll I don't blast at them. Right. Eh, don't, yeah, don't, a don't aggravate them yet. Just what exactly are these? The these are clay golems. Clay golems. Which will easily be crushed. Easier than Easy metal. So I guess we just fire it then. Okay, how so? Eldritch Blast. Magic Missile. <laughs> so, Eldritch Blast. Magic Missile. Um, first and third one will impact, which is minus 26. Then they have to roll a con save to see if it'll blast through them. Did which is a failure, so it'll make take 26 to the next one. Okay, that is also a problem, because apparently these are also not formatted correctly, so that the HP... All the HPs are oh, minusing. No. It's that thing again, so I have to reform. I just have to go through all the enemies again and just uh, reformat every single one. Just to make sure there's no discrepancies. I swear to God, she's attacking this one, we're going to punch her. Okay, she's electrocuted and she's on the ground. I think she's not going to be able to do anything right now. I'm talking about Heart Flame. Okay. She doesn't care. She has other things to worry about, like, I don't know, a bunch of golems in front of her. So, that is three... No, that's not it. That's uh, two impacts. Three of them are absorbed. Because their clay, their clay type, so a little bit of fire is not going to help, not going to hurt them too badly. So, minus six and then minus seven. Okay, so... 
and onto them. Which is, their speed is extremely slow, but they can do this. So... That's AC dexterity saving throws and... Yeah, so... Yeah, let's not use that just yet, they're too far away. So, they have to move... They can only move... What is their speed? <laughs> Their speed is 20 feet, so I was correct. 40. It's, tw it's 20, it's not 40. So I did it, and then did it. Okay, yeah. But it was the uh, they uh, 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 So. So they're all moving closer. So. The Admiral on top is, like, the one in front. You see that his arm, like, he, he takes the coat arm off of his right arm, and you see that he's drawing what looks like a rifle that goes down the this entire arm length. So he's going to make a long shot at disadvantage from where he is. At a uh, heart flam. So, disadvantage. Which, yeah, that's past her armor, so... Must roll a DC 14 constitution save or be blasted back, so... So she survives the shot, but the damage of the shot is quite heavy because, you know, she goes down almost immediately. So that is an insta kill blast. So she's down on the ground. What's her HP? Uh, less than that. That's like insta kill damage. That's 19. She does not even have that much health. Yeah, so. Jesus. She's, she's supposed to be a dragon. She's supposed to be a dragon, but she's, uh,. She hasn't really advanced much, plus, you know, she kind of got, like, messed up in early in her life, so her health has not been the best. Parts of her insides were cut out. So, you know, Heart Flame's a personal story, but anyway, it's just, uh, he just casually pulls back a shot, and he doesn't even try to hit her, like, he's not even trying to really aim it too hard, and then well, next okay. thing you know, a shot rings out, it's really loud, I think everybody can hear it in the area. See, it's loud enough for everyone to hear, and you see Heart Flame just gets blasted through through her right shoulder, and you know now she's bleeding pretty heavily. Wait, what happened? Well, I just came back. Point that this was going to stick to the medieval theory. Okay, I did, but he's got a few. They've got a few tricks. So like he said, uh, there's a few tricks up the sleeve. Literally, yeah, a, ha ha ha. A fucking rifle up the what? sleeve. So. What happened? What? I this is it is technically somewhat medieval. This is uh, just the advent of medieval. It's uh, they've gone a little bit into firearms, but these are like he I'm has to reload it after every round. It's like flintlock. Okay, I have a question. Mm -hmm. So the admiral shot rifle through his sleeve or what? No, he oh, has a rifle back. embedded on it. Like basically, the rifle goes up his entire arm, and he just did. He fired it, and heart flame got hit. Okay. Got it. Of course, I have one other. Th oh yeah, he said there was one other thing she could have did was uh, deck save, and that's to prevent her so you know hit cover, which still you know not enough. Is it against anything? Is it against anything? Yep. So still not enough. This as much as I want to save, it's this is an inevitability. At least she didn't get knocked ten feet back, or knocked prone. So okay. Yeah. So Spicoli, you're up. I want to grab this and then slam it into this. Okay. With, uh, there's so many people in the way of that, there's plenty of ways that could go wrong. I have 10 foot reach. Okay, basically, so grab this. I said there's plenty of ways that could go wrong, like you could actually hit somebody. But alright, give it a shot. Hold on. If he throws it in this way. Then it's, not, then it's likely just going to go through the flayed bandits. Like I said, it's uh, give it a shot. That's a strength roll. Just pure strength? Yeah, the strength. Because you're of the same size, so you can just use a standard strength roll to, to dominate him. So he has to use a strength roll to counter your strength. Just not enough. He tries to, you try, you basically wrestle with him a little bit. And then, he pick, then you pick him up and you just throw him. Into this. Yeah, so it's not enough to kill him, it just knocks him down. So this, it does kill the one that's flying, but it doesn't kill the one that you hit it into. That's kind of the plan I had. Okay, and then so. I just punch the one over there. You don't have enough actions, you just used your action. 
Ten foot. This good one's already yeah. dead. Yeah, but he already yeah. used your action to pick up that dude and throw him. Can I step on this then? Okay, that's a bonus action. So. That's a movement action. Okay, it's a movement, so there you go, so. Okay, so, Thorin. Uh, no finesse, just headlong assault. It's, uh, you know, somebody just went down, so his idea is, you know, I need to be on the front line, because... I so need to take the he hits. is going to use a dash, which means he's going to go really fast. He's going to use this bonus action to get into combat as fast as he can. He can't use it as another attack. He's going to leave Dawn back to, like, kind of watch over Heartflame a little bit. But, you know, this is pretty much Thorin is going to do his own little war. So he's in rage mode. He's going to start swinging his axe. I really need to macro some of this stuff because it would be faster. So, does he have advantage? Let me check his thing. He has advantage of initiative, which I forgot again. He can attack twice. No, he doesn't have advantage on attack, so... Okay, so he just has normal rolls, so... Once, twice, three times, which is, that's another crit. Woo doggy. So, one, two, three, <laughs> so again it crits for 18, which is triple damage. Hey. Wow. So, that's wow. 12, minus 12, and then uh, minus 54, and then minus 19. So he can't do a coup de gras, so he, you know, he didn't have enough time to do so. He just charged in as fast as possible. They'll tell you're up. Fuck that shit up. Or attack me with my rapier and then cleanse it. Okay. So 22, and then 13, which is too low. So roll one damage. That's minus 15. Deadly, you seem a little, uh, on the, I don't know, <laughs> it just seems like horror has no, happened. I'm, oh. I'm doing some homework. Kind oh, good dope. Oh. Yeah, so, I guess that's it, and then you clench him for 14, so. And Mark, you're up. So, you hear the shot ring out, you guys didn't have a very, the only Spicoli really had a good visual on it. You guys were behind golems. Let me check something. Okay, so. Uh, just, just remember our yeah. previous rules still apply, which is it's, uh, the three down rule. Which is if you go down three times, then you're dead. If you go down two times, you become maimed somehow. Just don't get her so, up yet. Yeah, so. Despair and stare. Well, if she stay stays there for too long, like it was a minimum of five turns, she'll die automatically. Spare. No, it's, um, you die automatically if you fail... Oh, three, three death saves. saves. Okay, so, yeah, so... But is she gonna try to death save, or...? Yeah, I guess. Head of maybe? Okay, let's see. Hold up, uh, so Marky, it's really Marky's turn, so... Yeah. I'm gonna move dirt. I'm gonna use... Misty... Actually, no, yeah, I'm gonna use Misty Steps. Okay, so you're gonna teleport to... past everything into where you need to be. Yep. That was over here. Just move yourself. I just need to check the basing, sorry. Just move yourself. <laughs> and then I'm gonna charge 20 into this guy. Okay, so it's all your movement. So you're you're with Thorin on the front line. Wait, why into that guy? Why not finish off the one go. who's like there already? I thought Spicoli said don't go to this guy. No, he said the one that he just picked up and threw. <laughs> oh, okay. So, so guy, no, this is Thorin's target. Thorin doesn't care. It's like it's all about just murdering everything in sight. All right, Which he's I'll very take. good at doing. I'll attack this guy. He's Ooh. very good at murdering. That's things. a hit. So, that's a hit. 
So that, right that is fatal damage. That's dead. That's uh, you do one quick slash on its torso, and next thing you know, it just falls. It turns into mud and just falls to the ground. All right, then. Three more to go. So, Olga needs to roll Constitution because she got electrocuted. Challenge rating, and she failed. So she's gonna be on the ground for a while, just trying to get her bearings. Okay, so say you're up again. Um, I don't want him shooting again, so I'll move the well, well, recast hunger of Hadar over him. Okay, so if I can select this goddamn circle. What I miss? Okay, so. Oh my god. Man, that was pretty much blinded him, hunger. so. Yeah, Kung Hunger Hate actually oh, cast you right on it. Was there, like, any anger in that, or was it just, like, basic? There's probably a lot of anger in that. <laughs> I, I sort of just yell, fuck off! Yeah, so. <laughs> so you throw that, and now they're they're in the, the Hunger of Hate R. Maybe if Notor cast the uh, cloud, I'll be able to explode it on someone. <laughs> okay, so. Yeah, cast the cloud. That was a so exactly okay. So question: It's they can move out of it, right? Um, they have terrain. half their movement. Okay, so they have they can move thirty, so they can move just fifteen. Let's see, could they they know what direction to move out? So so he's outside the cloud. He's outside the cloud. That one has to move forward, but he's not gonna really get out of the cloud. The stone golems okay. are blind, and the stone golems aren't gonna move. He's just, he can't fire his main weapon because he just used it, but he is just going to fire blindly with his other weapon. Oh, Disadvantage. Take cold Double damage at the start oh. of the turn. Okay, how much is the cold damage? Just roll it. So. Yeah, so minus eight to each of them. So before they get out of the cloud, they take cold damage, and he takes acid damage because he's still in the cloud. Was he at the roll for acid? I don't know, I'll just roll it. <laughs> so, uh, Dex check. Uh, Oops, wrong one. Uh, that should be a DC 17. One sec. Yeah. So, doesn't Failure. matter. It's crit, crit fail, fail anyway. Crit fail. So, does his what legs happens? burn off? Do his legs burn off? No, it's his weapons are malfunctioning. Like he goes to he goes to do this, which is he shoots his three pistols, but then they malfunction and they blow they up in his hand <laughs> on his arm. Ooh. They blow up on his Ooh. arm. How yeah, much so damage it's uh, the piss. Let's see. It does um, pretty much the arm. Like that arm can't be used anymore. Not even to swing a blade because the the web the mechanism blows up on his arm. He, so basically, he blew his arm off. His, like, so, oh. so he can't shoot from that hand, nor can he. He can like his weapon's destroyed on that hand. Plus, he can't use that hand to swing a melee weapon. So he crippled his hand. Yeah. So yeah. like in most arm. his hand and his arm. So. Like, he so wanted to just shoot blindly out of the cloud, but yeah, the, the mechanism went off. And, and damage-wise, that is good 2%. That's not a lot. <laughs> Damn it, why do you go with the D20? Why not do yeah. 100, like us? Uh, well, yeah, let me just... Because that would have been too easy. <laughs> so, oh, come on, I'm 3 health. Really. No, really, it's a pretty yeah, but he already cri he crippled his own arm, so he lost his arm health, so... Alright. So he only has one, he can only swing one cutlass now. If he had cutlass. I don't know if any of that will survive, but... So... The other ones, they're going to try, but the said, like, they, after, like, they were raising their weapons, but as soon as they heard that, it's like, uh, they, they decided otherwise. Poof! <laughs> Yeah, so. yeah, good idea. What about these golems? <clears throat> Which golems? Oh, the, the ones in front? Yeah, they're gonna charge forward. Like, uh, they're gonna charge they're at Thorin, they're, they're gonna charge right. at Mark. You know, the, he's talking about the clay golems. Oh, okay. So, you're in front, which means two of them are gonna come at you. They have a multi-attack, which means double We're slam. Up. You can you impose disadvantage on them. That's a fail. So... That's a fail. So that's only oh, yeah, that's I only two out of four. So I forgot to roll um death saving throw. That's a hit. Roll that now. Okay, so that's a fail. So the one you got one hit. So 
it hits for 20 bludgeoning. So, so don't get hit, because these hit for really high numbers. So, death save. She got one success. One success. What, you don't have medical knowledge? I, I didn't attempt to help her on my turn. Okay, anyway. So, Spicola, you're up again, because... Because you're up again. Uh, I'm assuming this is grappled, like, permanently, almost. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah. I guess. I guess Niltor's gonna take his time killing it. Okay, By so, hold guess. on. Can I charge this golem and try to, like, beat the shit out of it? Uh, not without trampling Thorn. Thorn would have to roll a dex to get out of the way. Can I, like, curve? Yeah, you'd have to you charge at an angle. Like, to the left. Yeah, okay, char yeah, I'll, so charge to the left. Like one. Yeah, and then boom, like you know, like that. actually do the attack. <laughs> okay, okay. What do I roll? Just attack. You said you're gonna hit. you're gonna shoulder charge into, slam into him. That's a strength roll. <laughs> I'm gonna speed run at him and then charge That's my right. punch. It's still a strength roll. So yeah, it's plus eight because it's a hit. So. <laughs> plus eight. So what does Damn he get? Twelve? What does he get? Oh. No, so just barely, so exactly what are you pun where are you punching him? Chest cavity. Okay, so And he just ex like his chest cavity just explodes and you see it expand outward until he just turns to dust. So like I guess whatever's controlling them might be in the center of their chest. Let's see, did uh did you guys catch on to that? No. Because you guys are a little engaged with the whole Enemy thing. Kind of busy. Yeah, you're kind of busy. <laughs> so, Could I roll an intelligence check for that? Yeah, you you know it can happen because you are the one who performed it. You, the others oh, don't because they're engaged. I automatically about. know that. Yeah, because you just did. Yeah. Okay. It's like hit them in the center of the chest and they'll I, disintegrate. But yeah. Could I try to garble in rock speak to like Marky or Thorin? Let's see. Uh, you can try using your bonus action. That would be persuasion. Um, I think that's just talking. And that still would be, like, you have to... They're in the middle of a heated battle. Okay, I'll just so. do persuasion then. It's plus nothing, so... Let's see how it goes. Yeah, so... Above five. Ah, crit one. Oh. So, they can't understand can't rock speed. hear you. Too busy. <laughs> yeah. No, all you hear is... Oh. Yeah, just random rock sounds. <laughs> so... Thorin being Thorin, Thorin's still in the heat of battle, like he's still in rage mode and he's still got three attacks, so of course he, that's the first thing he's going to do is simply walk up to the nearest living thing and swing all three axe swings at it. He actually misses one for once. That's another crit. <laughs> yeah, so... Yeah, he's got a high chance of criticals. No, wait, no, they all hit, never mind, so... Yeah. Two, three, Two, so that's three. 15 times three, times so three, that's... So. 45. Minus Another 19, minus 14, and then 15 times 3. It's 45. Yeah, 45, so. Yeah. Yeah, so Probably now we're on to Nilto. Same thing as before. Okay, so Fine. you're just going to keep going until it dies. <laughs> yeah, basically. Okay, so. the anger is giving me just die already. I'm gonna go Olga's turn fast because she's only got one thing to do, and that's try and get up from being electrocuted. So still on the ground, still in, See, still sure trying ain't. to get over it. No, Let's wasn't see. it? A, wasn't a five test for her? So what is it? A five test? Let's see. Can we use the pre? No, we can't use it. It's new every time, so she's trying to recover from. Every time it's gonna be a different challenge rating. So no tours, just unless somebody gives this. her medical attention, that's the only counter to that. So, minus 11, and then minus 12. And then you have to do the hand. And that's minus 15. So, it's slowly getting there. So Just one more. Now it's Marky. You're up, the, you're up again. Alright, I'm going to attack the one that's right in front of me. Right, uh, the thorn was attacking. Um, I'm actually going to use... I'm going to use Valve Enmity. Enmity, I mean, one more time. That's, uh... And then <clears throat> I'm gonna attack really with uh, 